not Jinjira trying to open this door for five minutes. <laughs> like it really hurts really bad here. The scab literally got ripped off my knee. Damn, that's a lot of blood. <laughs> Good morning! Currently 8.30 in the morning and we are at the practice courts and by we, I mean Janjira and I! So we're playing today in the afternoon so we decided that we're gonna come in the morning to hit a little bit first because I feel like I tend to play better in the afternoon when I play in the morning. Is it you too or is it just me? Because I feel like I can breathe better. I'm not tired in the afternoon if I train in the morning. Yeah, I the same. I train in the morning yeah, like you're warm already, kind of. So that's why we're here so early in the morning. And also no one's here yet because the practice schedule starts at 9. But we're here earlier than that because, you know, we're hardworking. <laughs> My camera's about to die. No. Okay, I'll try to film a little bit. Not Janjira trying to open this door for five minutes. <laughs> what are we gonna do? We can climb up. Really? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Many hours later. You got this. <laughs> A few moments later. <laughs> the key is <laughs> stuck. <Okay. laughs> no. I think we're just really bad at using keys.
After my match against Yo Jamin, I lost in two sets, 22-24 I think, and the second set was 11. The bird was extremely fast. Literally, we played without clear, without lifting, because whoever clear lifted would clear or lift out for sure, because the bird is just so, so fast. So we literally just played box, and whoever got control of the net first literally won. The first set, I mean, I don't think she played very well. I mean, I don't think I played very well either, because we both couldn't really control the bird. But a lot of times in the first game, she lifted a couple times out so then she lifted softer and then it was kind of floaty so then i could attack and that was pretty successful basically whoever got the attack got the point most of the time in the first game near the end i slipped i don't even know why because i didn't dive i didn't think the court was wet but i slipped basically i was pushing off my right leg to go to the left side to my backhand and then my right foot slipped and then i think i strained my adductor muscle on the left side right here like it really hurts really bad here now when i try to use power i was deciding on whether to go to physio or not but it's literally not free at this tournament isn't that crazy guys usually for high level tournaments physio is free for this tournament it's 30 euros for 30 minutes or 50 euros for 60 minutes which is crazy that's so expensive i don't have any more matches if i had a match tomorrow i would have went to physio hopefully it'll be better before orleans masters which is next week also at deuce in the first game two times she served to me short and i net out literally so dumb so so dumb just so many unforced errors at the end because i guess i was too rushed to win because it was so close also at the middle of the first game i dove which was a mistake because if you guys watched my polish open vlog i dove last week and you know when you get court burn and then it's kind of like an open wound for a bit and then a scab forms so basically a scab formed and when i dove again the scab literally got ripped off my knee after i dove i realized and i was like shoot that was a mistake because i didn't even win the point <laughs> do you hear that <laughs> ginger is having a concert in the bathroom basically i dove and the scab ripped off my knee half of it ended up on the court along with some blood and then half of it was hanging by a thread from my knee after i dove i was just like looking at my knee i was like no it was like recovering and then now it's back to square one it's really 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 disgusting immediately it started bleeding like it was dripping down my leg and i was literally like damn that's a lot of blood they had to stop the match for a bit because you can't play on court with an open wound and blood on the court so he quickly stopped the bleeding and he put like gauze on it and when he put the gauze on it It hurts so bad. It's already like an open wound and then he was like, I'm gonna disinfect it now And I was like right now. He was like, yeah, and then he took out his spray and I was like, no I'm like not right now Like literally I'm gonna like cry because you know when you disinfect a wound it like burns really bad He just put one of these on and then at 11 in the second game I really started feeling my adductor muscle after my game. It was like all right But then now that I've cooled down it like hurts it's really bad in the second game, I, I really like couldn't move. It would hurt when I lunge on my left. I couldn't really follow up my shots. It's so unfortunate because I feel like I could have won the first game. But even if I won the first game, I pulled my leg already. Oh shoot, is this blood? Oops, you guys see this? 
I did try my best. I wish I would have gotten the first game. This is gonna hurt so bad when I try to shower. I'm not looking forward to that. Hopefully I'll recover before my tournament next week. Last tournament before I can go home. Guys, I'm really homesick and usually I'm not homesick. I love to be out and about and I love to be around my friends and around people and meeting new people. But I've been out and about since January and it's now April. Yeah, I just wanna go home. Oh, you can eat sushi after losing. So sad. <laughs> Look at <Who> this. Put it in my mouth. I know you like it. So good. It's mm. good. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe if you would like to. And I'll see you guys in the next one.